just coming into Boona. We head back to Boona today. So we've got that Clydesdale spectacular show happening. Beautiful day here in Boona. Although it is only about 20 degrees Celsius. But, uh, we're going to have a look and see what this has got to offer. Spectacular in Boona, Queensland, Australia. Clydesdale shows and they have all sorts of classic Australian activities. See what we can see. We'll see what we can see, hey? Lots of history. Clydesdale Spectacular. And I'm just going to get our tickets and get the band. There you so go. We can go Enjoy. In. Thank you very much. <laughs> We're good to go. There you are, Ken. You've got plenty of audience support. We'll be back at 3 30. Kim will also walk in the
sign.
and uh, most of the fire went straight over our guys' heads. 800 men charged and they suffered 18, 18 dead. Other casualties, but it was a quite extraordinary result. They over, jumped over the trenches, engaged the Turks and captured the wells, which made the, turned the whole of the uh, desert front around. At that time, they were armed only with a sword bayonet. Now that's a longish bayonet. And Mike, you went well, you went good. Well. And Abby? So what we're going to show you today is some of these skills. Um, we'll do a bayonet charge first and take these balloons out, um, going one way and then back the other, and then we'll do some tent pegging. Now, the light horse didn't actually carry lances in the First World War, but they were used for sporting events. And uh, so these pegs are only six inches long, two inches wide, and normally you take them at a full gallop. We have to be a bit slower here today because this is a shorter field. Um, but it'll give you an idea of what it's about, and uh, I hope you enjoy it. And uh, anyone who wants uh, to have a go and thinks they're good enough to do this, if think it looks easy, come and see me and we'll sign you up. Love to have you. Thanks very much, people. Have a great day.
Kirsty McKinney, could you come to the ring too? Our other judge, Kirsty, Kirsty McKinney, the other supporting judge. Thank you, Kirsty McKinney, if you can come to the ring. And our live horse there, you'll see as they do the challenge, the stampede, go to the balloons. Juveniles, the juniors, the open. 
they'll be using on Australian leather. So they like to promote Australian leather. They have the crackers, the balls, and you'll see them do a bit of a workout at the judges' discretion. Oh, that's cute. 
Do you want me to take a photo for oh, you? Oh, we're all good. Thank you. You're all right. <laughs> yeah, she wanted to come over and show the horse her horse. And nice. Okay. Nice. Can I get a shot of your horse for YouTube? Yeah, sure. I want to put the little girl on. Oh, you're fine. It's all good. Oh, no. She's like, can we? With the horsey in horsey? the background. And the dog. Sit down, Titus. Hey, puppy. Australia Traveller. Hi, guys. We, um... <laughs> I thought we'd come out and look. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. What the show is all about? Yeah. You've got a matching horsey. Yeah. How good is that? Hey? You gonna say hello? Whoops. Beautiful. <laughs> What's fired you up? Did you just realise that they're horses? <laughs> Did you only just realise that they're horses? Yeah. Did you? <laughs> Did you only just realise that there's horses there? Hey? <laughs> Didn't you realize that it moves? <laughs> no, no, barking. No barking. <laughs> no barking, Samson. <laughs> Samson. <laughs> no barking. No barking. Good boy. No barking. <laughs> You got all tangled up now. Come here. Samson. Hey, 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 Samson. Let's hope he doesn't fall. Angus. Now Angus. Or have you named him? Took him ages to actually realise that it was a living, yeah. breathing. There's a lot of There's a lot of Thank you. Thank you for Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I got my old horse from the, they call that the point. My name is Judy and Silver. <laughs> Cool. 
The boys over there. Bernard one on that offside front. Make sure he's got his nail holes in the right spot. Except that horse has got a few cracks now. Also, it's really important he gets the nails in the right spot and not in a crack.